today's a very exciting day. We get to go see my family in Austin, Texas. But before we get there, we have about a seven hour drive, not including the breaks we have to take every hour. So the most exciting thing you're gonna get today is a lot of driving and then some maybe some family footage at the end. So I guess we'll document each, I think that's a big bubble bee. I guess we'll just document each stop. So we just drove our first hour, pulled up to a Love's. I thought it was gonna be a Love's country store because that's what the map said, but this is just definitely a normal Love's and that's a big old bee right there. But <laughs> gonna grab a little snack and then we'll be on to our second hour. How you feeling one hour in? I'm ready for Bucky's. <laughs> yeah, that'll probably be like stop number three, but I'm looking forward to it too. Yeah. Yay. All right. See you then. Before we went to our next stop, we noticed that we were actually right next to what used to be the GW Zoo. It's those who watched Tiger King. It's the Greater Winwood Zoo. Obviously, it's, prob it's permanently closed now, but we kind of wanted to see if there's any leftover signage or anything, but yeah, it says, according to the map, it would be right, you turn into right here, where it says no trespassing. Uh, so it was like all wow. this on the right. Oh, wow. It closed until further notice, not up to the public. Oh, there's a, you kind of see a cage? Yeah. And all the no trespassing stuff. Free Joe Exotic. He was framed. Stop, which is a bit more of an uneventful stop, is Costco for gas. We are currently heading out of Dallas. We just grabbed gas, and there's quite a lot of traffic, but it seems like it's because there's this huge accident up here that's blocking like at least three of the lanes. And I'm just hoping that it's okay, or whoever was involved is okay. Okay, actually. It doesn't seem that major. Okay, cool. Good. Good, good, good. And we're back with more traffic. Looks like there might be another accident up there. We see some flashing lights, but... There are the cars. Looks like it was one, two, three cars. There. Not too much damage. I'm sure everyone is okay, which is really good. Yeah. You, you built like even this and I haven't even walked in yet? Yeah, so this was completely empty. Oh, wow. oh my goodness! Wow! This is <laughs> awesome! Thank you. You even built a little shelf! Brittany was the carpenter. You were the carpenter? Oh so I built the bench, I built the kitchen, I built our bed, I built the upper shelving. Wow. Down How here. in the world did you do this? Learn from YouTube. Wow. This is unbelievable. Thank you. Um, but then this is Chris's doing, which I think is what makes it a home, is... Oh, <gasps> look at that. 
and all of our outlets work. I you forget, these are oh. like halogens or something. Yeah, they're in a little baby oh. LED lights, yeah. This is your um, ventilation. Yeah, so if you just go like this, it starts going, so ventilation. Yeah. And the, but the nice thing is if you don't want it running, yeah, see, so we had just manually opened it just to get air through if you don't want it running. So that's what we had open oh before. God. But if I'm being honest, my favorite fan is this little <gasps> fan. Because it just blows us right next to, um, yeah. while we sleep and it's got three little yeah it's on a gimbal so it you can oh, it switches all the flip it like things. any axis oh my goodness this is so impressive thank I, you i'm i'm really amazed thank you so much I am this too. looks like um what year van is this 1994 94 not no you were a carpenter i didn't know she, she didn't she didn't know it either at the time funny. Oh, Seriously, you built the, you built out the inside of a van, and Chris, who are you taking pictures? I'm taking a little video. Just a video <laughs> is an electrical engineer, yeah, and puts up oh. like halogen LEDs or whatever. This is amazing. <laughs> to our Walmart in Midland, Texas. It's getting close to midnight, so I think we're just gonna knock out and we'll start up again in the morning.